Yeah, Mafia Magazine Radio. Ferg, is that you? Yeah, that's me, brother. What's good, bro? What's good, baby? Hold on for a second, man. Let me shut you up real quick, all right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. For, for all my listeners out there, man, I, we got the opportunity to sit down with one of Southeast and East Coast's well-seasoned artists, and he goes by the name of Ferg. And me and Ferg will sit down for a little bit, man. He gonna let y'all know how he getting down on his side of town. So, Ferg, baby, I mean, how the industry treating you these days, baby? I mean, you know, it's a cat fight to get up in there, man. But you know, we, you know where we come from, bro. We struggle, but we make do. No doubt, feel me? Yeah, no question. We, 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 Got to make room for a brother, son. They got to make room. No doubt. So, 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 tell all the listeners, man, exactly where you originally from and how long you've been doing the things you've been doing. Well, you know, as as you know, because you know our history. You know, I'm a Brooklyn, New York, born and bred. You feel me? Mm-hmm. East New York, stand up, Marcy, stand up. Yeah. You know, been, been in the music, man. Been doing this music thing for damn near twenty joints, brother. Uh-huh. You feel me? Yeah, no question. So you know that that's what it is, man. You know, Brooklyn in the house once again. No doubt, baby. You know so, the great ones. Yeah, that's another great one on the list. The truth, feel was, me? The, the truth is gonna be told. No question about that. Yes, you sir. Know yes, sir. No sir. So. So, so, Ferg, tell us, man, originally, man, what, what actually or who actually inspired you, man, to make you feel like, you know what I'm saying, um, or who you heard rapping or, or, or speaking, you know, whatever it may be, um, oh, that inspired man. you to do what you want to do, to do the things that you're doing today? Man, man, listen, man, first and foremost, man, Rakim, brother. Yeah. That brother, Rakim, Big Daddy Kane, KRS-One. Yeah. Early Jay Z, Jay Z now. I mean, you know, it goes, <laughs> man. It is what it is. You yeah, feel me? Yeah, no. I was even on the Poor Righteous Teachers back then. A lot of brothers don't really understand that. Right. X Clan. Right, Them right, dudes, right. man. Yeah, no question. You know what I'm saying? So you picked some real winners there, baby. I'm saying, you yeah, know, you, man. You, you went back to the origination of actually hip hop, man. You know what I'm saying? And, and like I said in, the, in, the, in, the, in your introduction, you know what I'm saying? I'm talking to a well seasoned artist. You know what I'm saying? So this guy. Yes, sir. He, he, Saying it ain't like this cat just popped up yesterday or two years ago. You know what I'm saying? This cat right nah, here man. been around it for ain't. a while. You know what I'm saying? So, so Ferg, tell us, man, where did Ferg come from? Where would your moniker of being Ferg come from, man? Give us a little insight on that. Well, I can give you a little insight on that. I'm gonna take you back. At first, I was down with the group, this group called Housing, man. Mm-hmm. You know, it was me and another cat. I'll leave the names out on that. Mm-hmm. You know, we was down with this. uh with, a, with with Shaggy, man, you know the reggae guy. Right. You know, I was doing was doing that for a minute. You know, we was moving pretty well. You know what I mean? But you know, some things it just just everything don't usually work out. So right. you know, I kind of lost touch with who that character was. Right. And right. found myself. You no, feel me? No doubt. And once I once I stepped away from them. You know what I'm saying? You know, it, it was more or less a situation where people want you to do what they want you to do. Yeah. And I never really conformed to that. Right. You know what I mean? Right. So at the end of the day, I had to be who I am. Mm-hmm. And Ferg, man, that's on my birth certificate, brother. <laughs> <laughs> you feel me? No doubt about- I ain't never lied about who that cat is. <laughs> I, I live him 24-7. Yeah, no doubt. So, so, so give us a little insight, man, on actually where you actually derive your material from. I mean, you know, I'm not going to tell a story. I'm going to let you tell a story. But, you know, give us a little insight, man, on, on, on how you kind of gather your material, you know what I'm saying, and then bring forth it to life. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know, it, 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 everything I basically go through, man, is a personal experience. You feel me? Yeah. So it would be, you know, whether it's a negative or a positive, it could be a personal experience coming from myself a personal experience coming from close cats around me. You know, I take from all, I take from, from every aspect that's around me, you feel me saying? No and I bring it forth. Right, you know, right. I, I hooked up with, I hooked up with my brother from another mother out on the California side, out of Oakland, my big brother CMT, uh-huh. a platinum, pro- yeah, platinum producer, man, and he saw some things that I knew, and I saw what I, you know, and I saw some things that I knew as well, right, right, you right. know? So we, we, we kind of put it together, man, and it's like a match made in heaven, man. Mm-hmm. I know that might sound cliche, but it, yo, really, it's right. a match made in heaven. Right. The brother, the brother brings some music. He bring them tracks that, man, mm-hmm. and the tracker tell the story. Right. You feel me? Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? And, and a lot of cats don't know that. A lot of times, you know what I'm saying? It, it takes some chemistry between 
two brothers or or, or a brother or sister, whatever it may be, but twenty yeah, persons. Yeah, man, is two what I brothers, say. man, really do. Yeah, you know what I'm saying is what I should say, you know. But but it seems to me that you y'all put this together really well, you know what I'm saying? Like from listening to your music, man. You know, <laughs> I'm saying, man. You know, I know you for a long time, but but we're yes, not talking, you know. So we're not talking about me right now. We are talking about you. Right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's what's up. <laughs> and 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 it just seems to be that the the, the the union that you and your man have made, man, it seems to be a real good one. You know what I'm saying? And 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 you know, just tell us a little bit more, man, about exactly, you know what I'm saying, on on how y'all vibe together when y'all doing your thing. Oh man, first of all, man, a, a lot comes from the struggle, man. Right. You know? Mm -hmm. It'd be the struggle of wanting to it's a lot of people out there who are talented, man. Right. You know what I mean? And right. they just don't really get that platform mm -hmm. to be able to really express themselves or put it out there in the manner in which, you know, right. the, the world get an opportunity to hear you. Uh -huh. You feel me? Yeah. And so, you know, with, with me and him together, man, it's like we vibe off each other so tight, saying, yeah. you know, it's like he, he could look at you, you. You ever had a man where you could look at your your homie and be like, yo, yeah. I know what you're going through, bro. Yeah. Just just by that look. Right. You feel me? Yeah. And, and, and when it comes to that emotion, once again, that emotion right. brings out that music. Mm -hmm. That brings out them words. That brings forth what you hear. Right. You feel me? No doubt about and, that. And, 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 you know, certain songs, man, certain songs I was angry when I wrote. <laughs> certain songs I was happy when I wrote. Right. Certain songs I was feeling melancholy or feeling like, you know, hey, I've seen a big booty chick. I might want to holler. And then, you know, I put it on some paper yeah. and roll with it. You feel me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ain't no doubt about that, man. And that's, that's, that's a that's a true union, you know what I'm saying? When two cats can actually get into a particular place, you know what I'm saying, to get into a particular circle is what I should say, and be able to vibe. Sometimes, you know what I'm saying, you can look at a cat, you know what I'm saying, and you can finish that cat's finish that cat's thought, you know what I'm saying, or or yes, that cat sir. automatically knows, you know what I'm saying, to turn it up or turn it down, add some reverb, you know what I'm saying, put some echo to it, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. So, Word up. <laughs> so so a lot of times, you know what I'm saying, you know that just goes without saying, man. On on some time, what if a beautiful, a beautiful union can be some time so all right so for here i got a question for you man you know what i'm saying like like i said man you well seasoned you've been around a little while I, you know i i want you to give me a little insight man on on how you feel the state of the game is today you know what i'm saying from from, oh, from what it was man. at one time to what it is today and i mean be honest you know what I'm saying? i mean we ain't gonna I'm call no real. names and nothing you know what i'm saying i ain't but, going real i feel you i feel you i'm, I'm just gonna be real with you i'm listening baby the state the state of the game back when, saying, and you know what I'm talking about, when the dudes was really flipping, I mean, like you had the early J coming in, spitting. Right. You had Nas spitting. And I'm going to take it back even a little more. You had The Firm, where you had cats like AZ mm -hmm. spitting. Yeah. You had dudes like Large Professor spitting. Right. You had people who were spitting things that was content. Right. And you know where we come from, bruh? We are the people of content, Brooklyn, Queens, Manhattan, mm -hmm. that. And, you know, we, we put it out the way we put it out. Yeah. You feel me? <laughs> we basically giving you an inside view of where we at, what we going through. Yeah. You feel me? Right. And nowadays, man, the game is, you know, it ain't a lot of people out there that impress me verbally, man. Right. It's just not. It's a lot of this little, I, I, I call it kind of popcorn music, bro. Yeah. You feel me? No There's a lot of cats out there who get away with certain things. You get in the door, make a hit, and then you feed the public trash. Right. right you know what I mean? Right. And hey, you know, some people gonna like what I'm saying, some ain't. Yeah. But at the end of the day, <laughs> truth you truth. can't see me. Yeah. <laughs> at the end of the day, <laughs> you can't see me, bro. Yeah. You know what I mean? I ain't no and that's why I'll that. take it back to like, you know, the, the Rock Kims and, and, and KRS ones. Bruh, you know how they was getting down when they put it. No Big Daddy Kane, they they was laying it. You no feel doubt. me? Yeah. So so with all that being said, do you consider yourself, and I already know the answer, but I want you to tell the people, you know what I'm saying? You consider yourself a rapper or a lyricist. You know what I'm saying? Man, I am I'm a verbalistic individual, my brother. And let it this be known. About the lyrics. <laughs> it's about the lyrics to me, homie. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. It's rapping. It's rapid fire when I open my track. No That's doubt. all I'm going to say. No question. You know? Yeah. No question about that, man. So right now, man, you up in the, where you at now? You up in the ATL right now. You know yeah, I'm, I'm up in the A right now, laying. You feel me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So so I know you putting things out right there, man. On, on, on How they receiving you? How was, how was the reception of your music being taken up there in the ATL, baby? 
in the A, man, I get, I get a little bit of love. I call it 50-50 love, you feel me saying? Because you know what? I'm going to say 50-50 love because you know out here in the A, there's a host of New York cats out here right. as well as, you know, you got some other Florida cats, D.C. cats. You know, we down here, it's a fluctuation of us, man. You right. feel me? Right, right, right. But you know, when it comes to that side, I got some, I got some real ATL cats that feel my music. Mm -hmm. But then I got some other ATL cats that you know, they're a little bit shaken by what I do. <laughs> you know, and I call them, it's like they scared, man. They scared of me. <laughs> That's because you, they you know they not you see, me. You know, sometimes there's a thing about when we, you know, being rough, rugged, and raw, you know what I'm saying? And some cats really don't understand that because they haven't lived the lives or come through the struggles that we've come through. So right. you know, they're they a little hesitant, you know what I'm saying, on, on, on kind of being exposed to something new or somebody new. You know what I'm saying? Right. And, and, and right. with somebody coming at them with the rawness that you may be speaking, because I know you, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> and I already know, you know what I'm saying, that a lot of times, when you're speaking, you're speaking the truth, and some people just can't handle that. You know what I'm saying? And so, I mean, yeah, you know that that kind of that kind of scares people, man. It does, man. Like I said today, man. You know, not to not to not to pull some from somewhere different, but I did say it today, man. It seems that fake is the new real. Yeah, I, see I don't that. conform to that, man. Yeah, yeah, really, yeah. I really don't conform to that. Yeah, I a lot of dudes. They lying to themselves, and they, you know, they lying to themselves. They lying to the listeners. They, the radio is, 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 is bugged, man. Yeah, I it's get it. It's just a bugged out situation where you have people who really feel you, and then you got other individuals that might be a little hesitant or afraid because, you know, you coming in, and, 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 and that hesitancy comes from a sense that they feel like, oh, man, I might lose my spot to home. Right. <laughs> you right. feel me? Yeah, no doubt. Yeah, that's... I, I've been through that quite a bit, man, with dudes feel like they're going to lose their spot. And, and, and that's, and you know. Yeah, and I'm glad you spoke on that because that was kind of like one of going to be one of my next questions to you. Okay. You know what I'm saying? About, about you know, being at where you at and, and then knowing the things that you know, you know what I'm saying? Is it, is it is it a is it a hard thing for you to actually be able to sit down and vibe with some of these cats or collaborate with some of these cats in the music that you're putting out today? Right now, I'm going to be real honest with you. Mm -hmm. Brothers, if you ain't coming right, mm -hmm. you won't be on my joint. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't rocking with you. I'm just, you know, yeah. I, had this con I had this conversation with a couple homies and sis, you feel me? Yeah, no she doubt. Was even try she was even trying to get me. She was like, you know, bro, you really going to have to, you know, kind of bend a little bit, man. You might have to let one of these dudes get on here and let them do their thing so that you know you get a little light from that and you know, it'll expose you a little bit more. Right. But my thing is this, man. I cannot do anything with somebody who whack, brother. Right. And if I feel you whack, I can't do it, whether you out there or you not. Because at the end of the day, right. for me, if I'm putting you on something, it's, it's like, you know what? They say birds of a feather flock together. No doubt. You feel me? I'm not, I'm not in your league, homie. And right. if I'm not in your league, I can't play with you. Right. Because like my, like a basketball coach once told me, man, you play to your competition. Yeah. Now, if your competition is at an elite level, well, you're going to raise your game mm -hmm. to that level. No doubt. But if you're going to sit there and play with bums, then hey, <laughs> you know the rest. Yeah, well, that don't even need to be said. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? That's self-explanatory. You know what I'm saying? Yes, so, sir. So, so give us a little insight, man, on your optical game, man. Of some, oh, we got some videos coming out. Do we need to be Yeah, looking? man, we got... We got the videos coming, man. You know, I've been in the studio, but I just, you know, just this week, man, this week past Monday and Tuesday, banged out eight new joints, okay. you know. So, brother, been working, man. I'm, I'm, I'm getting it all in line, man. Yeah. I'm trying to let the stars align, man, so when, they, when the ball drop, mm -hmm. it drop on them heavy. Yeah. You feel me? No doubt. It's like I said, rapid fire, baby. No question. Got the videos coming. Got, got new joints coming. I mean, the album, I got albums. Tucked. Yeah. And ready to rock. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah, no doubt about that. So 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 you already answered my next question. You know what I'm saying? I was gonna, <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I don't mean to jump ahead. Hey, like hey, that, hey, 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 that's all right, baby. I lived on the third floor, you live on the second. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. So, yes, so sir. It's okay, man. We understand this. You know what I'm saying? So yes, so, so like a couple of months from now, you know what I'm saying? You already let us know you just dropped eight more joints, you know what I'm saying? And then uh let me just say this real quick. For all my listeners out there that y'all 
listening to right now, I want y'all to stay locked in. You know what I'm saying? Because we got some tracks. Ferg ain't just talking. We got some tracks that we ain't going to bang for you to let you know hey, how he really getting down on this side. You, side know, you, you know. know what I'm saying? How he really putting his work in. You know what I'm saying? And so I just want to let that be known. You know what I'm saying? And and so, Ferg, baby, you know, before we go, because, you know, we, we, we a little, you know, we're under time restraint right now. But, but before oh, we, good. yeah, no doubt, baby. But before we go, man, I want to give you an opportunity, you know what I'm saying, to to shout out and plug everything and everybody, man, that's helped you get to the point to where you are today. That's what's up, brother. First off, I want to thank you, my brother, for allowing me to get up here and holler the way you let me holler, bro. You no, feel me? No doubt, baby. You know family. My man, my man, my man. <laughs> and then, you know, I got my brother CMT, you know, CMT Miraculous. That's my producer extraordinaire. Gotta love him, gotta love him. You know what I mean? I, I, I thank Sam and Sue Harris, my grandparents, yes. looking over me. You already know, Sam. Yes, sir. You already know, bro. Yes, Got to bring them to it. Got to bring them to it. Down. You know? Yeah. And, 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 man, my man, Dirt Dig, man, my boy, Forax, Doc. You know, I like to thank the fam, my seed, for keeping the brother level-headed and pushing still. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Yeah, no doubt. I mean, you know, yeah. I, I got love for all those who got love for me. No question. And you know, it ain't too many mine, ain't too many brothers and sisters out there that I really rock with. I keep my circle close and tight knit. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Small circle, so when we blow, we all gonna eat. And we gonna eat. No you question. feel me? No doubt. For all my listeners out there, yeah, for all my listeners out there, man, right about now, man, you listening to, you know what I'm saying, your hope saying grip. And we also talking to the cat Ferg. You know what I'm saying? And y'all stay locked in, baby, because I'm getting ready to put some fire to you coming explicitly <laughs> from Ferg. You heard what I'm saying? Hey Ferg, baby, it was a blessing that you came out, man. You spent your time with us, man. You know what I'm saying? You gave us a little insight, man, on what it, you know, how it goes down where you at. You know what I'm saying? And I just want to say to you, man, may you always be blessed, and may you always continue to prosper. And if there's anything Mafia can do to help you do the things that you're doing, don't hesitate to get at us, baby. That's what's up, brother. I appreciate that, man. No, you know the love is there, man. No doubt. So baby. that's what's up. Yeah, baby. Peace. That's what's up, brother? Peace. One hundred, bro. <laughs>